something that is difficult to find in our world. Peace tonight is an opportunity to pause and allow God into our lives. Christ the King welcomes you and encourages you to sit back, relax, and allow God into your space for the next 30 minutes. afraid. Lift up your voices, the Lord is near. Lift up your voices, the Lord is near. In the Lord I'll be ever thankful. In the Lord I will rejoice. Look to God, do not be afraid. Lift up your voices, the Lord is near. Lift up your voices, the Lord is near. In the Lord I'll be ever thankful. In the Lord I will rejoice. 
Look to God, do not be afraid. Lift up your voices, the Lord is near. Lift up your voices, the Lord is near. In the Lord I'll be ever thankful. In the Lord I will rejoice. Look to God, do not be afraid. Lift up your voices, the Lord is near. Lift up your voices, the Lord is near. In the Lord I'll be ever thankful. In the Lord I will rejoice. Look to God, do not be afraid. Lift up your voices, the Lord is near. Lift up your voices, the Lord is near. Blessings and peace to you tonight. Hear these words from John chapter 15. You did not choose me, but I chose you. And I appointed you to go and bear fruit, fruit that will last, so that the Father will give you whatever you ask him in my name. Hear these words. Taking this particular verse, if we just leave it there, we miss out on the joy of what it, how it fits into the greater text. So this actually begins in the very first part of the Gospel of John where Jesus goes and says, hey, come follow me. And his disciples say, oh, okay. And they just went. And then as we go, we hear about the stories of what's happening with Jesus through teachings and through the miracles and all of the other things that make Jesus so wonderful. And then we get to this last part, starting with John 13, going through 15, where Jesus has many intimate moments with his disciples, his dear friends, washing of feet, a last supper. And then he makes this commandment, to love one another as I have loved you. And then we come to verse 15, or 16, excuse me. I chose you. I chose you. And then he talks about bearing fruit, but we'll get to that in just a minute. So the first part, I chose you. Now Jesus at this point could have chosen uh, any number of people, but he chose this exact 12 group of a motley crew not the greatest of saints that I would call, but people that represent who we are. A bunch of folks that think that they understand what faith is all about, but lo and behold, they stumble all the time, yet they follow without question. Jesus chose them. Which then, how does that apply to us? I get so excited that here, all of those stories were many moons ago. Jesus still chooses us, just like he chose this disciple. And here we are, a group of a motley crew. Yes, those who are online, you're a part of that motley crew of misfits. And here Jesus says to us over and over again, I choose you. Even though the storms may be rumbling about in your life, I still choose you. Even when we say that we are not good enough, we point your fingers at ourselves and say, man, there is nothing good inside of me. Jesus still chooses us and says, I love you. I choose you. But then how do we respond? Here, Jesus has given us this gift of love. How do we respond? 
Well, the next part of that verse is to bear fruit, to go out and bear fruit by taking this love that, that Christ has bestowed upon us and to love other people. So if you love Jesus, show that love to other people because Jesus has chosen them and there are many people in our life that haven't quite heard or have experienced what that love is all about except when you encounter them by saying, I love you with your gifts, with the however God has bestowed upon you to share this fruit of this love that God has given to you. This motley crew is more than just 12 people. There are thousands of people who need the fruit of God's love that are from you. So if you feel like you are chosen tonight, today, or whenever you're watching this, how can you be a bearer of love out there in the world? Amen. Amen. Let us continue our time in prayer as we proclaim that prayer that our Lord and Savior taught us to pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Oh, chosen ones, let us continue our word of prayer through the gift of song. Let us pray. Watch, O oh Lord, with all those awake this night. Watch, O oh Lord, with all those who be. Give your angels and saints charge over all who sleep. Tend your ailing ones in your love, Lord. Rest your weary ones in your love, Lord. Bless your joyous ones in your love, O Lord of all. Watch, O Lord, with all those awake this night. Watch, O Lord, with all those who weep. Give your angels and saints charge over all who sleep. Soothe your suffering ones in your love, Lord. Heal afflicted ones in your love, Lord. Shield your joyous ones in your love, O Lord. So, oh Lord, with all those awake this night, watch, O oh Lord, with all those who weep. Give your angels and saints charge over all who sleep. Hold your grieving ones in your love, Lord. Raise your fallen ones in your love, Lord. Mend your broken ones in your love, O Lord of all. Watch, O Lord, with all those awake this night. Watch, O Lord, with all those who weep. Give your angels and saints charge over all who sleep. Guard your little ones in your love, Lord. 
guide your searching ones in your love, Lord. Grant us all your peace in your love, O Lord of all. Watch, O Lord, with all those awake this night. Watch, O Lord, with all those who weep. Give your angels and saints charge over all. Bless the Lord, my soul, and bless God's holy name. Bless the Lord, my soul, who leads me into life. Bless the Lord. And bless God's holy name. Bless the Lord, my soul, who leads me into life. Bless the Lord, my soul, and bless God's holy name. Bless God. 
Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget you. I will never forsake you. I will never forget you. I will never forsake you. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget you. I will never forsake you. I will never forget you. I will never forsake you. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget you. I will never forsake you. I will never forget you. I will never forsake you. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. Listen, listen, listen to my heart song. I will never forget you. I will never forsake you. I will never forget you. I will never forsake you. Gracious, wondrous God, we just give you thanks for being a part of our life. Thank you. Thank you for choosing us. Thank you for allowing us to worship your glorious name. Continue to choose us. These things we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. May God's blessings be with you this day, this night, this morning whenever you're watching. May you be filled with God's grace and love this day and from now on. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. Amen. Let us conclude our time together in song. is
brings us to the end of Christ the King's evening with you. We hope that you have found a bit of peace for your life tonight during our time together. May God bless you and bring you peace until we meet again. Good night. Hey folks, Pastor Scott Kimmer here with Christ the King Lutheran Church. Thanks so much for worshiping with us. If you like what you see, subscribe or like us with YouTube or Facebook. If you'd like further information in regards to our church, go to ChristTheKingOV.com. Additionally, if there's anything that we as a church can do for you through prayer, through conversation, please don't hesitate to contact us as soon as you are able. But may God's blessings be with you this day.